if Kamaru does win, he's talked about going up to 205, which is obviously a massive jump. But then in the pay-per-view after, you've got Hamzat versus Nate Diaz. Is it fair to say if Hamzat wins that fight, he'll get the title shot? It's fair. I don't ever do that shit, but yeah, it's fair to say if he wins, that's the fight to make. He's already beat everybody twice in the, in the top, whatever. So, um, yeah, that makes sense. You know what doesn't make sense? 205. <laughs> but you know what? The, look what the guy's done. He said, I want to go fight at 205. What am I going to do? What am I going to tell him, right? Why would you not give him the opportunity? It's a bit too early to say this, right? But say Kamari wins and then Hamzat beats Nate Diaz in what's probably going to be a massive fight. How big would a fight between Kamari and Hamzat be at this point? Huge. Yeah, it's huge, especially if he wins uh, the Nate fight. Absolutely. Thanks, Dana. Leon Edwards in the blue. Seth Bozinski. Oh, oh, it's the Yeah.